Adventurous Kaya believes she lives in the most beautiful place on Earth. Leaping salmon swim up fast-moving rivers, and herds of horses graze in the lush valleys. Kaya's people are the Nez Perce of the Pacific Northwest. She dreams of becoming a fine horsewoman and leader among them, wise and strong like her grandmother, and brave like her hero, the young warrior woman named Swan Circling. Yet, Kaya must first gain the respect and trust of her people. She sets out to prove her skills in a daring horse race, but puts herself, her horse, and her twin brothers in danger. This earns her the hurtful nickname of Magpie, a bird that only thinks of itself. That nickname stings every time she hears it. One night, Kaya makes another terrible mistake. Raiders sneak into camp to steal horses, and without thinking, Kaya rushes to save her Appaloosa instead of taking her blind sister to safety in the woods. Both girls are captured and taken far away to Buffalo country. Courageously, Kaya manages to escape her captors. She finds the trail to her homeland, guided through the wilderness by her elders' lessons and her respect for guardian spirits. When Kaya is home safely, she works even harder to become as strong and true-hearted as her mentor, the fearless Swan Circling, and to lose that unfortunate nickname, Magpie. Today, Nez Perce girls still gather to hear stories and legends told in their native Nez Perce language, just as Kaya did. They love to dance and share their beautiful weavings. Most of all, young girls look forward to parading their horses in honor of their ancestors, whose inspiring spirits live on to nourish all Nez Perce people each and every day of their lives, just as in Kaya's day.